Hello everyone, my name is Amber. Welcome, welcome back to my channel, Amber Reads Romance. Today I'm gonna to be doing my TBR for the month of June. I'm excited for a couple arcs and some of these reads that I'm gonna be doing. So I'm gonna do a quick video just kind of going through my TBR. Um, I do apologize if you can hear my AC in the background, um, but I'm sweating. It's hot in San Diego today and sitting in front of this light, I was starting to sweat. So we don't need that. Um, so I apologize if it's, you can hear it, but I kind of need it on for this video. Um, so anyways, let's go ahead and dive right in. I will be probably looking at my notes because I have them written down on my binder here. Um, but I did want to do, read a couple books that were mafia books. Um, Jen from the book refuge during the mafia readathon, she read a couple of these mafias from Jagger Cole and I've never read anything of his and it's going to be interesting to read. Like I like reading male authors to see the difference. Um, and she really enjoyed those books. So those were already kind of like on my TBR, but she, there's an arc um, for Jagger Cole's next one in that series. So I got that arc, so I'm super excited. So I wanna read the first two books first. So um, I wanna read Deviant Hearts and then Vicious Hearts. Um, and those are both by Jagger Cole. And then the arc that I got is for Sinful Hearts. And so I'm, I think that releases June 15th, I believe. So I wanna get those two mafia <laughs> reads first gotta dive right into those so I can prepare for the arc um, and then the uh, buddy read that we are doing for the month of June is gonna be liars like us by JT Geisinger so I'm really excited to dive into that one I hope this one is gonna be our first five-star read um, I love JT Geisinger she's an amazing author I love her monsters and queens series so I'm excited to see what this series is going to be like and if I'm going to love it as well and then the other arc that I got was bookshop cinderella um that I believe releases June 20th so I plan on reading that it's a historical romance an author I've never read before so I'm interested to see how that goes um, then I am also participating. I want to do um, the Tessa Dare read along. So quite a few of those books are going to be like I have them. They're all on any place. So I plan on listening to all these books. But basically for the read along so I can read along with them um, for the month of June. And this is like um, Rachel Reads and Sings and Tip Talk Pages and all that. They're all doing this. And so I'm going to read A Lady by Midnight, Beauty and the Blacksmith, um, Any Duchess Will Do, Lord Dashwood Missed Out, Romancing the Duke, and Say Yes to the Marquess. So um, those are all quite a bit of books to read in June, but luckily they're on any play. Um, so I'm excited to listen to those audiobooks. Um, and then a couple of the new releases that I want to read is Reckless by Elsie Silver. I was so bummed I didn't get this arc, um, but I've seen such amazing reviews already from the people that got the arc, so I'm highly anticipating that release, so I'll most definitely be reading that. Um, and I believe that comes out June 9th, so I'm excited to dive into back into that Chestnut Springs world. You know, Heartless is like my favorite, um, so I'm excited. And then um, Keep Her Safe by QB Tyler is coming out. Um, I think it was like a bodyguard taboo type romance, which QB Tyler always does. So I really want to read that book. Um, and then some of the other books that I really want to read, um, a couple, some of these were actually on um, some more audiobooks, that couple audiobooks that I wanted to read this in May. But I got the audiobook kind of tour thing for Instagram for Lucia Franco's Off Balance series. So I had to read those. <laughs> so I kind of had to push some of these audiobooks back to June. Um, so some of those, those are going to be Children of Fallen Gods by Chris of Broadbent. That's the second part of that fantasy series. And then Dust Walker by Tiffany Roberts and Scoundrel of Her Own by Stacey Reed. So those ones were on my May TBR, but had to read the Off Balance series by a specific date or listen to it on the audiobooks. So I had to push those back. And I'm having such a great time listening to the Off Balance series. Uh, it was It's really cool to listen to an audiobook this time around. 
And so some of the other books that I want to read, um, I want to continue the Say a Spell series. Um, so I, the next one I have is Always Practice Safe Hex um, by Juliet Cross. I'm loving this series. I loved the last book. It was so, it was five stars. It was amazing. So I'm excited to jump into this because now we're gonna get a Grimm and I'm really excited about the Grimms and to learn all their powers and all that. Um, then I have Her Way by Nikki Harris. I had read her first duet in this series, which was about uh, Max Butcher and it became one of my six star reads for Cosa Nostra. Read it during the Mafia Readathon. Um, I have a vlog. I'll link it down below. You can see me cry on camera. It's really ridiculous how emotional that book got me. So I'm really excited to continue on in that series. Um, and then I have, haven't been on top of my um, Serena Ackroyd where I'm reading both her MC and the Five Points Mafia series. So the next one that I need to read is Filthy Sex. Um, I kind of didn't read any. I don't think I read any in like the last month or two. It might just be a month. But like I fall, like I really wanted to get through this series. So I need to read that. Um, I'm excited to read that because it's going to have Cammie from the MC where she was with Nyx, but he really treated her badly. She was kind of like the club whore. And he basically found the love of his life and totally tossed her aside. And she like, I think was like really in love with Nyx. So and I, I've heard, you know, that her story is just really sad so i'm interested to see her story and her going back to like the five points mafia and everything like that okay sorry i was trying to figure out what my next one on my list was and i totally drew a blank but now i remember i want to read uh heart recaptured which is the second book in tilly cole's motors mc motorcycle gang so uh, series um, those are pretty dark, revolving around a bad cult and all that kind of stuff. I love the first book, but as you know, I'm really bad at continuing series. I kind of go back and forth between series, so I need to get back in there and finish reading this one. So I'm excited to read that book. Um, and then I also am going to be continuing with my Pam Godwin. I read Dark Notes this month in May, and it was so amazing. It blew me away. And so I am going to be reading Sea of Ruin, which is up here. I didn't take it down, but Sea of Ruin, I'm going to read that. I, it's a historical pirate, dark, dark, dark romance. So I'm definitely here for it. And I have a feeling it's going to live up to the hype. So I'm really excited for that one. And then I'm going to read a couple novellas. I want to read Release, which was Claire Kent's, um, her Kindled series, which I love Claire Kent's Kindled series. So I'm excited to read that. Um, and then The King's Spinster Bride um, by Ruby Dixon. That should be a really cute novella. I think she like saved somebody from being killed. They were, he was kind of held as a hostage of like another king's son. And then she saves him from being killed. And then I think he comes back as an adult like wanting her. I think. I'm not positive, but it sounds really cute. And I love Ruby Dixon. Um, and then I wanted to finally get into Triple Threat, which is... Um, by Kay Webster and if you've read her Cinderella series um it's these triplets that were freaking monsters in that series and it's their romance so you know it's gonna be dark you know it's gonna be taboo it's it'll be all over the place fucked up that I love of Kay Webster and I love it so I have had that on my Kindle forever but I haven't gotten to it so I really want to get to it this month so that's going to be it for my June TBR. Thank you so much for watching this video. Um, I'm very excited to read a new author to me, which is Jagger Cole, and dive back into some more mafia. Um, so I really appreciate you watching this video. It's a little quick one, um, but please don't forget to like and subscribe, and I will see you on the next one. <music>